real bad. Little, yeah. Okay, what about this one? It's supposed to be 128. How, yeah. What does it sound like? This one is, I call this light, light tan maybe, and this is dark brown. All right. Do you want to write that frequency on here so you don't forget? That's what I did. Okay, you're going to put it in? Yeah, I'm just going to stick it inside the thing. All right. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. So now we're going to do this. Water. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. So now we're going to come, and they need to see right. this. So this is our second yeah. official lab. We've had a lot of different things. I'm like the cameraman right. now. <laughs> so the first lab had two parts, the speed of sound of the pulse and the speed of using the tension in a string to vary the frequency so that you can get what the density of the string was. Okay. Now what we've got is, what does that say? That's a 2 that was, dumb. that was dumb. All right. Yeah, two. Would you get me a meter stick, my dear? I think it was. Who knows what it is now? I think it says C sharp. Now that it's now that it's dropped on the floor, it's probably nothing remotely to what it used to be. Two fifty six. All right, that's what it's supposed to be. All right. Wait. So how does that change it? It's bent differently now. Probably oh. Different. Well, every time you every time you drop tuning forks, you sort of rearrange their macro you know, their molecules, and so then they don't vibrate quite as well as they oh. used to. Oh. Zero down. Good. Okay. So now, are you ready? You're recording. I am. You're holding the tuning fork. When you hit the tuning fork with your hand or your shoe but don't hit it with the table or drop it on the floor, all right? Then what you're gonna do, what I'm gonna do is you're gonna start, you're gonna hold the tuning fork so it vibrates like this. Yes, okay, but don't touch it, just above it, okay? And I'm gonna start lifting this and you should hear a resonance state. That is, you should hear a loud sound wave. All right, so when you're ready. Okay, you cut, whenever you touch it, you cut it off, so you can't touch this. And you want these want the things mallet? at the very end. Like this? Nope. Um, you want it just oh, okay, like, that. like that. Okay. And you gotta move away from me. Okay, so now I hit it again. <laughs> Is that the loudest? Yeah, okay, hit it once more. <laughs> I think about there, what do you think? Yeah, that's good. Okay, now I need two measurements. Okay. I need to know where the water level is against the meter stick. Um, five, or yeah, five centimeters. Five centimeters? Nope, it's going up. It was five centimeters. Okay, then we need to do it again because I'm unsteady. All right. Do you want to hold? Yes. Okay, I'll come around. Okay, so it's somewhere near here. Okay. <laughs> All right. And Should you I have to... one to see the five centimeters? Uh, I don't know, honey. Okay. okay. Yeah. <laughs> Why not? Why not? Okay, actually, here. The, if I have to move to look at it, that's probably not good. Okay. Are they at the same? Like... They're reasonable. You can put them down to the bottom and then raise them up. All right. So put them down to the bottom together. In fact, if you don't want to, you don't have to raise the wheeler. You can just raise the white. Okay, I was going to say, because that's hard work. Okay, so now just raise the white. And you're going to raise it up to here, so it'll... Keep coming up. And she goes away. It's because you're lengthening it? If I hear it. And then it when it... Here. Okay, hit it again. at 17 inches. Is that what you like, Sarah? Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, I want Sarah to read centimeters of the white. 
Fifty-six point what? Fifty-six point eight. All right, now read where the water is. The, the white black pipe, uh, line or the no, bottom of where, the pipe? No, where the water, where the pipe is exiting from Here, the wait. water. Sorry, I'm going to get it back to where it was. Um, 23.7. Oh, okay. 23.7. Yes. Okay. So, okay, we're going to try again. And what was this for? Two what? 128, 256, to what? 256. Okay. All right, now, if this works, so now we're going to turn and face the board. Yes? All right? So, this point right here was at 56.8 against the meter stick. This point right here was at 23.7 against the meter stick. The tuning fork she held was 256 hertz. All right, are we happy? Mm -hmm. Yes? Okay, now, your PVC has an open end here and the PVC went down into the water, yes? But right here is where the water line is, so that means the water line acted as what kind of an end? Oh, um, uh, fixed. Fixed, because it can't vibrate. All right, so this is fixed. Fixed means no motion, right? So it's a node. This end was where she was sending in the energy from the tuning fork, so there was vibration here, yes? Mm -hmm. So this end is free, and it has large amplitude, which means it would be an anti-node. Yes. Good? Now, if you alternate letters and you get back to the same letter, that's a loop. Yes. If you alternate letters but you don't return to the same letter, that's a half a loop. All right? So this would represent how much of a loop? Half of a loop. So this is half of a loop, which is what part of a wavelength? What's a loop equal to? Um, one. So one quarter of a wavelength? One, yeah. Good. So a loop is a half a wavelength. So half of a half is a quarter. Means I have a quarter of a wavelength. Good so far? Mm -hmm. So now, this quarter of a wavelength is vibrating in this length of tube. Does it matter the width of the tube? Nope. Okay. So, what would we do to find the wavelength of this particular sound? So, we take the length of the tube and set it equal to one fourth lambda. Good. So and therefore, lambda would be four L. Four L. So for two hundred and fifty no for two hundred and fifty six hertz, we have a lambda of four times this difference, right? Mm -hmm. So what happens when you do four times this difference? That's a one and a three. And a three, so that means it would be four, twelve, thirteen, so yes. one point three four meters. Um, oh yes. Did I do it right? No, uh, it's just the change from centimeters to meters. So okay. Be off for a now second. we're going to do it for five more forks. Okay. So I want you to choose five more forks. Okay. They're inside this box. Here. Any five you want. Does it matter? I would make some variety to it. Don't do 257 or 8 or 60, but you can do anything. Back slow. Okay. Let's do it. 426. So let's do it. 349. Oh, let's get a tiny one. Oh, no, I shouldn't. You want a total of six. I think that's the least number of points we can do and feel good. Okay, I'll put this one back. And then, oh, here. That one's four twenty. I think it's good. <laughs>